During the installation of a Kiva Backup Professional, there were several options that you agreed to, but what actually were they? The second option was to enable a Kiva Backup Update emails. With this enabled, update checks are performed every three hours to ensure that your copy of a Kiva Backup Professional is the most up-to-date. When the copy of a Kiva Backup Professional running on your website discovers that there's a new version available, it sends an email from your website to you telling you that there's a new version with a special link inside which when you click on it will perform the update. This email is only sent to the super users registered on your website and the link is only valid for one use and is only valid for 24 hours. The email is not coming from akibabackup.com which keeps no record that you have installed Akiba Backup Professional on your website. The email is coming directly from your own website. When you click on the link, Akiba Backup Professional now performs a system restore point and performs the installation. Once that is complete, go to the components menu and select Akiba Backup. We now need to run the configuration wizard, confirm that we accept all those terms again and apply the preferences. Your copy of Akiba Backup Professional is now up to date and you have the latest version. If you want, you can change the way that Akiba Backup Professional sends you those update emails. To do that, we need to go to Extensions and the Plugin Manager. Find the Akiba Plugins and here we can see one for Update Check. Select that. This is the plugin that is actually sending you those emails. If you want to disable the functionality completely and it's not recommended, simply click on Disabled. If you want to change some of the other options, click on the Basic Options tab. Here we can change the language of the email. But more importantly, we can choose who to receive the email. Currently, it is sent to all the super administrators on your website. If you only want it to be sent to one of those super administrators, type their email address in here. Now, that update notification email will only be sent to this one user. Note, this email must be the registered email address of one of your super administrators, otherwise it will not work. To activate these options, click Save and Close.